Good evening ladies and gents, Smokey Joe here, and today we're playing some WWE 2K17. Uh, just against the computer, um, just wanted to talk a little bit about 2K18 really. Like, um, news dropped recently that the uh, PC version of the game is dropping the same day as the consoles, October 17th, which is good, because in, in the past... All of the uh, WWE games have dropped on PC quite a bit after the initial release on console, um, which was annoying for me because what I'd always do is I'd buy the console one and then trade it back in so I could buy the PC one as soon as it came out because 60 frames, better graphics, all that, all that shit, you know. Now the new one in particular looks really good because they've got they've they've gone out, they've done everything really. I'm going to be the Jeff Hardy downloaded character I got. But, um, yeah, they with the new one they've overhauled the lighting engine. They've added in new backstage areas. As you can see, I don't have much stuff unlocked on here because I did play it more on console this time around and unlocked everything. So that's why it's nice that 2K18 is coming to the PC at the same time. Because I can just buy it on PC and be done. And just play it as much as I want on the PC. And unlock everything. Let's go Jeff Hardy versus Mankind. Because why the fuck not? Yeah, I can't even remember what match you picked. I think it was Extreme Rules. But yeah, so the new one. They've overhauled the lighting engine, which is good. Like, they've... Looks like they've made plenty of tweaks. Now, what I'm hoping for is faster gameplay again, because I miss the old days um, when everything felt a lot faster. Like this, it always feels a little more sluggish in the newer ones. But yeah, so 2K18, I am just, I'm quite looking forward to it. It's the most I've looked forward to a wrestling game in quite some time, just because. I can say the, the new graphics look good, the backstage area was nice, I was excited for this because they added backstage areas into this one, but the backstage areas in um, 2K18 look like they've gone back to the old style, you know, there's massive jumps to make and, oh no, he's not going to get, I'm not going to do it in time, oh, he's got me. Yeah, so you can climb up things and jump off things, and that was always fun because they were always my favourite moments. As, as you can see, I've picked Jeff Hardy, but I always used to love those kind of moments in the old days of wrestling, really. But yeah, so 2K18 looks looks good. I am excited for it, but I think now I should uh, try and get myself into this game here because not really doing much it is an extreme rules match so i'm going to try and hit mankind with a chair see if we can uh, rival how many chair shots the rock put on mankind at royal rumble 99 oh what are you doing i don't want to go under the ring run that's cool but yeah um one thing that, that annoyed me that they stripped back in this game as well was they they oh he counted me back they Strip back the positions that you could place tables and ladders like they had their set positions which was a little annoying to me because I'd always try and do certain things and it just wouldn't work and like put the ladder in a certain place all that kind of stuff and it would always backfire it just for the stupidest reasons like it was slightly like I'd uh, put the ladder down oh shit run right, hit him in the face there we go right, so I put the ladder down and I try and put it at the corner of the ring, like prop, like not propped up, but like set up vaguely in the corner of the ring, so I could then put the enemy on a table and jump off of it. The amount of times in this game I have tried to do that, but the ladder has just set itself up in the middle of the ring, and I think, oh fuck it, I might as well try it anyway. And then, boom, you jump out of the damn ring. Can we please go back to the old way of doing it? It felt a lot more fluent, but so that's. Just a minor little nitpick, but yeah, the new one looks really good. But yeah, so right now, just wailing on mankind a bit. We've both got no counters, so I should probably hit him while he can, while he can't counter me. Just keep wailing on him with this chair. Let's make it a bit more interesting now. Let's let's get a table. Everyone loves a good table. Believe it or not, this is on the second hardest difficulty for AI here. Um, 
don't really know what to say about that other than that. Like, you expect it to be a lot harder than it actually is. Maybe I should put it up to legend. Oh, shit. Maybe if I put it up to legend, it might be a bit more challenging. Oh, that was... <laughs> just pass the table back and forth. Right, give it back. It's my turn. There we go. Good mankind. There we go. It's him. Still passing the damn table. Get it back. There we go. Now, can I hit him with it, please? Nope. Oh, well, at least it stopped the passing chain. Counter, maybe? Yeah, there we go. Nice little counter there. Well, not really nice. It, it was a counter. So that'll do. And this table's way too far away. <laughs> Just fucking ran, ran backwards around him there. Bit of snot come out my nose as well. Lovely. Right. I think I need to peace out of here for a second because I have no counters left, which is always worrying in this game. Counters are your best friend. You need to have at least one. Where's that chair? Is it around here? I don't know where the chair is. There it is. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Oh, and he's busted open. That's what you get, mankind. See, look, blood on the chair. Lovely. It's always an annoyance to me as well that you have to turn blood on in the options in these games now. It's like, no. Just put it on a standard, mate. Oh, he's counted. I'm not going to count it yet, because... I've got a bit of leeway here, so... I'm not going to count it yet. I'll let my, uh, let my counter build up a little bit first. So I don't waste one end a bit. Right, here we go. I've got two counters now, so... That's where I start trying to counter the moves. There we go. Hurricane Rana! Fuck you! little bit of a taunt. Showboat to the crowd a little there. Let's move this table. Put it here. That could work. We just need to get mankind over here successfully now. We'll do a little taunt. There we go. The taunts always seem to spur him on. It's like, oh, you're taunting me, are you? I'll come after you. Alright, let's get him on this table. Oh, oh, clunky. What? Oh, come on. That was some bullshit. Oh, now he's taunting me back. Can I get up? Please? Clicks. Oh, oh, he's measuring me for his finisher. Oh, no, he's done me. He might pin me here, folks. That'd be embarrassing. I had a resiliency, it's fine. Oh, I used my finisher. It's alright. I have to get up and start wailing. Oh, no, that's exactly what he's planning to do. Wail on me with a chair a little bit. Take that back. Thank you. Really? No, I can't counter for ages. This is unfortunate. So, kick out. Not even a two count. Come on, Mick. You can do better than that. Oh. Yeah, he can do better than that. Oh no, he's discarding the chair. Making sure I can't get it. If 
fucking serious? It's just countering everything now. Okay. This maybe hard's a little harder than I gave it credit for. Oh, he's gonna fucking do me again with the finish over it. Boom, do him right back with one. Go for the pin, because they always kick out of the first finisher. Can I, can I put it in the ring, please? There we go. Alright, give me a kendo stick. Where's the kendo stick? There it is. Right, come on, Mick. Come on. Heel tactics. Oh, as if. As if I didn't even get... I wasted a counter then, because he didn't get up quick enough. And now he's giving me a small package. Wow. This is bollocks. <laughs> Mick Foley. Both have no counts though, so... Oh, was that a signature? Oh, that must have been his signature. Fuck! <laughs> Damn. That was unfortunate. Pretty sure that's turning into my catchphrase. I say it a lot. Oh well. Can't even beat a computer on hard. Oh well. Should we rematch or should we try for a different? Uh, let's go. For, let's go for variety. We've got a five-star match as well, I suppose. Because I dragged it out too long. Um, hell in a cell. Always a good bet. Uh, Royal Rumble, why not? I know who I'm being in a hell in a cell. Ooh. Which one, though? That is the question. Uh, I, sp I suppose Ministry of Darkness Taker really is the way to go with this. Uh. Oh, we've got Taker 98. Uh, against Steve Austin, maybe? Nah. Oh, we don't have old Triple H. Or young Triple H. Triple H versus Jericho in that one. I don't know why I'm trying to make a match, like a proper match. Fuck it, let's go Jericho. Don't have the old Jerichos. It'll do. See if we can put him through the glitchy cell. That's another thing they need to fix in 2K18 while I'm talking about it, actually. Whenever you try and put someone through the top of the hell in a cell, it just glitches and they don't go through. It breaks, but they're just on the side of the cell. Like, uh, maybe I can demonstrate that in this match. Good thing about being Taker as well is I can build up more than one finisher. For some reason that Jeff Hardy I downloaded could only have one finisher. And Jericho, what you got for me? So I got a bat for you, Mr. Jericho. How about bat of Taker? Oh shit! Run! I don't think you would have ever seen Undertaker running away from Chris Jericho, but we're not going for a 100% faithful recreation of a match. So, oh, damn! Never seen Jericho power bomb Undertaker either. Oh, he's getting me back in the ring though, that's cool. Right. Man, my counter timing is not what it used to be. 
See, I really liked it when um, I, th I thought the uh, these games when they first started switch over were all right. Like 12 was okay, but I thought WWE 13 was the best one with the Attitude Era mode and that. That was so good, but it's a shame they've done that now though, and they won't really do it again. Because so many memories. Go old school. Old school. Walk that tight rope and come crashing down. Right. I think I'm going to save this finisher. I think that would be the smartest thing so I can then put him through the. Uh, Went through the old cell to get out. And still have enough to choke slam him on top of the glitchy bastard cell. Everyone's booing. What are you booing for? Chair shots are people used to love chair shots. So we got two finishes. It's time to chuck Jericho out of the ring. Yeah, there we go. He didn't get up, that's a little annoying. There we go. Right, come on Jericho. Do a little love tap. You move then. Yeah, there we go. Come on. Works every time. Get him out. Stomp him a bit. Give him a reason to get back up. Come on, Jericho. Follow me. And he's following. Not his wisest move. Come on then. Let me choke slam you. Oh, okay, never mind. Tombstone you instead. Busted him wide open. Fuck. What? Hmm. Nice. Let's fight him back. Not for long. Right, let's see if we can line up a choke slam. Every time. No, it isn't. Stop chanting. This is awesome. It sucks. They need to fix that. Here we go. This will work. And he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Not quite dead enough, because he's still moving. Hmm, I forgot about that. 
Come on in, Jerishmo. Take another chair shot to the face. Thank you. <laughs> he got wrecked. Kind of like I got wrecked in the first match, but yeah. But anyway, thank you guys for coming. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I am Smokey Joe, and I will see you next time.